Day 68 of the Captain's Log, March 26th. It's a cinnamon roll tail day, and we're in St. Lucia, and if you've been here a minute, you know this is one of my very favorite maneuvers to do, because I swing outside, back down the narrow channel, and then I get to parallel park the ship, starboard side, alongside the pier. After arrival, I went down to meet the safety team, because once a month, we put our launches, lifeboats, and rescue boats in the water, and that's to test their maneuverability and their engines. This is one of our launches or tender boats and it cost a million dollars a piece. Not only do these have all the bells and whistles, they have the most stylish tender captains. This is our Chief Officer Navigation, Liz. We use the launches to transfer us from boat to boat, so next up is a lifeboat. When you're thinking about the difference between launches and tenders versus right. lifeboats, size matters. Weighing in at 52,000 kilos, each lifeboat will hold 440 people. It's worth mentioning that we have more than enough survival craft capacity on board the ship. Celebrity Beyond can take a maximum of 5,303 people. And our total survival craft capacity, which is made up of lifeboats, overcapacity life rafts, and our MES stations, which are life rafts that are deployed through chutes, can cover 6,764 people. Lifeboats are for our guests, but we also have assigned crew members, for example, a commander and second commander. There are two 20.6 kilowatt engines per lifeboat. This is how the provisions are stored and that includes water and food rations. For water, there are three liters of water per person in the lifeboats and 10,000 kilojoules of food. Now, if you ask me what the food tastes like, I would say it's not quite as good as Marks and Spencer shortbread, but it's not terrible either. The black dots that are painted along the seats indicate where your bum goes. Some people are lucky enough to just go cruising through and others, not so much. I do find it kind of ironic that there's a CD player because who's gonna have a CD? Next up and weighing in at 38,000 kilos are our tenders. When we're doing tender operations, we have 132 people on board, but in a life-saving capacity, they hold 223 people. Each one is equipped with two 235 kilowatt engines, thrusters, televisions, air conditioning, bucket seats, and even fish finders. We have a system of davits and hooks, which we use to lower the boats to the water and recover them to bring them back on board. We also have a rescue boat on the port and starboard side, which we can use for man overboard operations. My third in command and safety officer, this is Panos. He's responsible for all of the life-saving equipment. That includes life jackets, immersion suits, life buoys, and everything you've seen here. Since I had the docking maneuver this morning, Panos has the departure, and our pilot has my favorite ringtone of all time. 